<laughs> oh, I'm so happy for both of you. Congratulations. Thank you. I suppose that my adorable son and his ever-loving wife probably knew all about it before I ever went to San Diego. You really think Lance would do something like that to you, Julia? Oh, please. This isn't a family. It's a snake pit. Oh, I don't think so. What in the hell are you doing here? There's something you should know. Your mother's desperately ill. Computer programming is really just like typing. I mean, that's really all a computer is. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Will you excuse us for a second? Oh, sure. This is ridiculous. Where is he? I don't know. He told me to trust him. What can I do? I don't know. Sometimes I think Dad's gone off the deep end. Will you come off of it? You have been telling me lies from day one, lady. I came here on my own. She didn't want you to know about her condition. Yeah, we've all got our problems. In spite of everything, she loves you. Why not give her a chance to prove it? She had her chance when I was born. Richard, it could all be yours now. I could be of great value. I doubt that. Without you, without a leader, the company will be torn apart. And you better get back there and start fighting for the scraps. I won't settle for scraps. And I won't leave here without you. Did you bring your goons with you? Sheriff, nice of you to stop by. I'm sure there's some people here you'd like to see. <laughs> Mr. Channing, I was looking for you. So I've heard. This is a subpoena calling for your appearance before the grand jury of this county within seven days. Aha. Uh -huh. I'll uh, be happy to tell them anything I know. He's stonewalling. I'm not so sure. You be careful. That fence you're walking on is beginning to shake. Have you seen Chase? No, isn't he here? No, no, I'm afraid not. Jacqueline, we, uh, we didn't think you were coming. I didn't think so either, but I only have one granddaughter. Oh, I'm afraid you've missed the ceremony. Well, I'm surprised you're having the reception here. Well, you know how forceful Angela can be, and uh, Chase and I just thought it might bring the families closer together. Well, speaking of that handsome husband of yours, where is he? I don't know. He's not here. Not here? No. At Victoria's wedding reception? Chase, I've been so worried about you. Oh, Chase, there's so much I need to tell you. That can wait. This can't. Where'd you find him? You won't need those, Dad. Mr. Fong is here to tell us what he knows. I'm placing you under arrest on a charge of accessory to murder. You have the right to remain silent. If you give up the right to remain silent, anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney and to have that attorney present during questioning. If you desire one and cannot afford it, an attorney will be appointed to you without charge before questioning. Do you understand these rights? It is time for honor and the truth. For the Chinese in this valley, life has never been easy. Mr. Agretti was a powerful figure, a rich man, but he had no heart. To him, we were nothing. That was no reason to kill him. My mother was never allowed to leave China. Mr. Agretti said he would help make a loan. He never did. My mother was very old. There was not much time left. Then, then someone offered Offer the money I needed. I, I, I took that money and showed the way into Mr. Greddy's house. Through the tunnel? Through the tunnel. I didn't know that, that he would die. That he was murdered. I did not know that, that he would be killed by you.
said he was going to ruin everything, wasn't he, Julia? First he forced Melissa onto Lance, then he fought my mother at every turn. He was going to bring Falcon Crest to its knees. And with Melissa here, it was only a matter of time before Carlo had everything in the palm of his hand. I would have left Lance and me with nothing. Oh, why try to frame Cole? Why try to kill him? And Maggie and me. Cole was made to order. A little hothead with a history of trouble with Carlo. He always did everything he could to undermine Lance. And another few minutes in that garage, the Agretti murder case would have been closed. My accident was a fake, too. Mr. Fong helped me set that up. And your accident? Well, you just wouldn't get off my back. You're really full of surprises, aren't you, Julie? That's right. I've saved one more surprise just for you. <gasps> watch it, watch it. Oh.